water is a very important resource within the mining uh, industry. We need water for us to, pro to be able to process our minerals. Uh, in certain instances, you find that you've got uh, excess water, or in other instances, you've got uh, deficit of water. So how you manage your water therefore becomes very critical because without sufficient amount of water, you won't be able to, to process. But in an event that you are generating excess water resulting from your process, managing that water also becomes very critical because that water has passed through the process, has gotten in touch, uh, in contact with the various contaminants, in this case, metals. Metals are not very good for the environment generally. When they report in the aquatic environment, they can cause serious harm. Therefore, whatever has to be discharged in the environment has to be within a, set, a certain spec above which it becomes a pollutant. We've done a number of uh, inspections within the main industry within Solwezi, which is Kansanshi mine, and uh, there is no evidence of pollution for surface water. That means water going into Kifuwa River, into Solwezi River, and further to Mutanda Stream. There is a point at which they have been licensed to discharge their water or effluent into the environment. And all these times that we have been there, we have found di zero discharge, and there is no evidence of water in the holding pond from which they are supposed to discharge. So there is zero discharge going into the environment, which is a very good point. So what we've done differently compared to other mines is that we've been able to sustain the zero discharge of effluent to the environment. Any overflows from the process plant uh, goes through a series of uh, sedimentation ponds where the, water, where the sediments or solids are settled. After the solids are settled, it goes, the water goes to the final pond, which you can call the compliance pond. Which is uh, that pond is fitted with um, a pumping system and a return line. From there, that water is pumped back to the process and uh, reused in the system. The achievement of uh, Kansanshi is unique, not only to the Zambian mining operations, but globally. It is very rare to find mining companies that are able to go zero discharge of uh, process effort. For other mining companies, I would encourage them to come and have a look at Kansanshi, how they are handling water from their tailing storage facility, from water that they are using in the process plant, storm water, and any other water within the mine, how they've managed to ensure that nothing goes into the environment. It benefits the community in the sense that the community is not exposed to pollutants or to pollution in short. You affect the, the aquatic ecosystem in one way or the other. Human beings also get affected. <music>